Hey guys, I am in my self tanning shirt. Every time I self tan, I feel like I wear this shirt. I'm gonna show you guys the self tanner I use because it's a good combo. So I'm going away this weekend, so I did self tan because I'm super pale. I wanted to show you guys what I use for self tan if you're curious. I always use a mitt. Um, to self tan and then I just use a elf brush like this to do like feet elbows and hands using a brush helps so much I use the Bondi Sands magenta deep tone I mix this with loving tan deluxe dark mousse I like them together so I just do one pump or two pumps and two pumps like equal parts this has like a purple undertone and this has more of an orange undertone. So I prefer to mix them. So I'll leave those linked down below, but I did self tan. I am going to just be getting ready today. I have a list of everything I want to do. So I had to get a reel done this morning. So I already did that. I need to edit a video. Um, I just want to get a lot of things done because usually I tend to do a lot of work on the weekends. Um, so I'm going to be packing today. I don't think I really have to go run any errands. I think I have everything I need. I'm only going for one day, so it's not really that big of a deal. I'm going to take my magic mind to get me right. <laughs> um, just to give me that little boost I need to go edit a video and start packing. But this is the magic mind. I shared this in my productive vlog. I'm obsessed with these shots. I love them so much, you guys. Seriously, I really do. And they have given me a discount code. It's Amanda Evolving 20 for up to 56% off of your first subscription. But these just really help me focus. Great source of energy. But really, um, what I've noticed the most with taking this is it gives me a really good boost of energy and helps me focus on one project at a time. So cheers to that. Check the link below for Magic Mind and use the code so you can get some money off. They also taste really good. I also am going to pack some of these because they don't have to be refrigerated. So I'm going to pack up a few of these. Um, so they won't be refrigerated on the car right there, but they will be It'll be cold enough, and then when I get to the hotel, I'll pop them in the fridge. One thing I did get, actually that's a lot. <laughs> I ordered some like Blitz. So my, um, I'm going away for, my, I don't even think I said so that. I'm going away for my nephew's baseball game, and his colors are like kind of like a electric blue and then like a bright orange like this. It's exactly just like this actually. Um, and I don't have like a little bag. The only one I do have is really big and it's tan so I wanted something and it's a shoulder bag I wanted something that could go cross body across my body um, so I could just like easily open it it's just easier to carry so this is so cute I love it so much it's the perfect size um, I like the material and the color is great this is the inside it has like a little separation and I got it from Amazon for really really good price there's other colors but I'm obsessed and I look like all the other moms because all the other baseball moms always have like cute little bags like this with the colors of the team so mine's a little bit bigger though which is good because I tend to carry a lot of stuff in my bag I just have hand lotion lip gloss my wallet sunglasses oh sunglasses speaking of that I also got these from Amazon I also always carry let me know if dry eye girls out there. I always carry some eye drops. Um, I got these from Amazon. So I have these glasses. I forget the brand name. So I have these, but they, something happened to them and they like are crooked. So they're like crooked on my face. And I kind of don't, I don't know. I wanted something a little bit more plain and solid. So I got these from Amazon and I think they look really good on my face honestly I tend to like bigger glasses but these are perfect and I love that you can see my brows because a lot of time big glasses cover the brows but these don't so I got these from Amazon I'll also have these linked for you guys but I think they're really cute and like sporty but kind of posh vibes <laughs> that's and then I just ordered like a few clothes from Boohoo that's supposed to come today, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed it comes because 
I got like some shirts that I wanted to get that were like blue and orange because I don't really have that much. I only have like one jersey with their name on it and then a long sleeve shirt, which is going to be way too hot for that. The high is like 79. So I ordered some stuff from Boohoo and when that comes in, I will show you guys. My Boohoo package arrived. I'm still in my tanning shirt. I wear this until I'm done tanning because it's like, it gets, it's brown so it doesn't show up the stains. <gasps> Ooh, this is the perfect orange, I can already tell. So like I said, I ordered like all orange and blue colors. I got this, this is a size 18. It's just a white tee. I wanted just like a shirt that's not oversized. I just wanted like a plain, more on the tighter side t-shirt. This is actually perfect. And I wanted something that was a little bit higher neck. I can wear that with like my little mini skirts. And then I'm wearing a jersey one of the days. Um, and I don't have like an undershirt and I didn't want to wear a white spaghetti strap. This is so cute. This is a bodysuit actually. So it's spaghetti strap bodysuit. This is in a size, with bodysuits I feel like you can always size down actually because they're usually stretchy. This is a size 18, but look how stretchy it gets. Um, this is really, really cute and the perfect color blue. This is gonna go so nicely um, with the colors. I'm so glad this came in. I was a little worried. I thought it was gonna maybe come in tomorrow, which would kind of be bad because I'm leaving tomorrow around like six and spending the night at my sister's so that Saturday morning we can all head out. Okay, now this I wanted big and oversized <laughs> because I'm wearing it with boy shorts. So as you can see, set you. I wanted it for when I wear boy shorts, I like it to like cover my stomach. So I just like a big oversized look. I think it looks cute. And then I'll have some boy shorts that probably like in here and they're blue and white with the orange shirts. Um, will look so good with the colors. I just wanted some options. And then this is an oversized beach shirt. I got this in a size, oh, it's a 14. So it's not really gonna be oversized as much it's probably oh yeah this was the only size they had so i just got it i mean it's a little oversized honestly it needs to be washed oh i really oh, i guess i could do a little laundry let's see how let me take this shirt off real quick i have a bra on so a sports bra which actually kind of goes because it's blue and orange is the colors i don't know how i feel about this one actually it's not my favorite i wish it was a little bit bigger honestly but it's okay, I just grabbed it because it was on sale, but I wish it was a little bit more oversized. But I could wear it with like, I have a white dress, like a white tennis dress. I could wear it with that. Okay, overall, pretty happy with this. These three are really happy. This is okay. We'll see if I even wear it. Cause it's gonna be like 79 is the high. But I love Boohoo. I love a lot of their stuff. It's so good. So that's that. I am going to blow dry my hair. I just um, washed it earlier this morning and I did a mask. Um, and then I let it air dry to where it's pretty much dry. Um, it's a little damp. And then I'm going in with the Bondi Boost Blowout Brush. I really enjoy this brush. And I just part my hair and start blow drying. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. The only thing I have in my hair is this heat protectant spray. I always use heat protectant. It's just the sleek iron heat protectant spray. So I might add a little bit more on this side. My dad's calling. Hey dad. Who's that? Mm -hmm. Like Danielle, Evie. Uh, hi. Hi, little cutie pies. <laughs> hi, cutie pies. What you doing? Just sitting in people's den. Oh. Are you sitting? Well, are you coming to Katie's game tomorrow? Yeah, I'm coming over tonight and spending the night, and I'm going with you guys. Okay, but guess what? 
What? Man, pops are turning. I know. Amen. He paused. Um. Um. He paused. Um. Fiscal's coming. Oh. She's coming to the game. Yeah. Yeah. She's going to try. She's going to try. Oh yeah, cause she lives kind of close to there. Twenty minutes away. <gasps> oh, have you ever met her? Huh? No. Oh, Virginia. This hair mask. Made it look so shiny. It was a California Naturals hair mask. And I really like California Naturals. Um, you can find that at Target actually. But I did their Shea Butter hair mask and it's making my hair look really shiny. see because I'm wearing a black bra but it turned out so good and then I'm gonna take these out these weren't in for long at all but I like my roots I've noticed they're just so flat so um, I try to put in some rollers to give it some body which it does okay I just have like heavy bangs but I did lighten my hair up just a little bit too which I think I really like. You can kind of see the lighter colors. But there's my hair. After a quick little blowout, that didn't take long. I've gotten really good at it. So I'm gonna start packing up my makeup. So I like to put skincare in this because if my skincare accidentally leaks, it's really easy to clean out. So I always save like PR packages that I get. Um, in the mail, I like to save them. So I'm gonna put my skincare in here and then I'm gonna put like makeup and hair stuff in this bag. So I always save my bags. It's such a good little hack for traveling. And then I also have this bag, which I might put like nothing in or I might put like perfumes and stuff. We'll see um, how much stuff I bring. I'm only going for one day. And then I'm gonna wear all the jewelry that I wanna wear, I'm gonna just wear um, now and um, probably just sleep in it. <laughs> if you wanted to know, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, you guys, I just packed. I have, I don't know how it looks like I have so much, but I filled this duffel bag up. I did need to bring a clothes to like hang out in because I'm sure the stuff I wear throughout the day, we get back to the hotel, we might hang out. So I did have to pack that and then something to drive home in. So I feel like that's why I had to, I didn't really want this to be so full, but whatever. And then in this bag, I'm gonna put all my stuff in. In here, I have, what do I have? All my hair stuff. I did bring my blowout brush, some clips. Um, did I bring a brush? Ooh, crap. Did I? I didn't. Where's my brush? Oh, my brush is in here. Okay. So, all my hair stuff and then all my skincare. So if it leaks, it's in a plastic bag. And then this is all like lotion. I brought my own soap, contact solution, and toothbrush, things like that. And then in here is all my makeup. <laughs> so I'm gonna put all of these little bags. So I'm gonna put all these little bags in here. Honestly, I haven't decided if I'm gonna film yet. If I do, I have to bring all of that camera stuff. So, we'll see. Okay. Okay, that all 
outfits. Cool. Perfect. So there's that. Also, I'm gonna bring my own pillow and blanket and my purse. So I wish I could have gotten everything in one bag, but it is what it is. There we go, packed and ready. I just know we're all gonna be tired. We're all gonna want these magic mind shots. So I'm taking all that I have left and packing them in my bag and then I'll refrigerate them when I get there. Come here, Virginia. So cute. my purse. Hello. My mom made this hat in the car. You stole it, huh? <laughs> We're here though, right? We got Starbucks. We all got Starbucks. Oh. Now we have to wait, what, an hour? Oh my gosh, Eve. There's the binky. Let me see, say, cheese. Do you want for each of them? Girl. Am I in it? Evie, look at me. Look at Anna Mena. Have your parents text you? Oh! bowl to split because we're so hungry and it's hot right mama <laughs> yes we're gonna split our acai bowl yes we are looks good doesn't it mm, delicious <laughs> they're over there hey guys Hi. jp how are you feeling good great um, Wes was like, um, why, why do you go to all JP's tournaments? My aunt doesn't go to all JP's yes. tournaments. Yeah, so it's my aunt doesn't I'm the best. Like his aunt is good. Yeah, yeah so that's because I'm the best aunt. Are you JP? Starbucks and honey. Come on. Miss Virginia. This sand in my toe. She wants an LOL doll. This sand in my toe. I don't want to get her. This sand in my toe. Oh, that Look sounds funner. The outfits. Toe. Clothes. Ooh. We don't have to be to the games until 2.30, so we're going to oh, shop around. What? I would just like to like not LOL doll, just clothes. Wait, With some shorts or something. 
you have a white, I don't know, a uh, white. You are you do. Oh my gosh, this would look so cute on you. But you don't like pink that much. Look at that. Um, oh, like, look. That's so cute. I'm trying to get the whole thing is you want to get pieces that are distinctly different. Oh, yeah. Actually, that's going to be <laughs> distinctively different. Distinctly different, you know? Oh, that's cute. Oh, but that How is many is this pretty. one? Oh, a thousand. That's a thousand. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. Yeah, but you're oh going to do gosh. it with her. That is distinct. I mean, what do you think, oh. honey? Honey, what do you think? Honey, what do you think? Which one? <laughs> And then look. What? JP is starting pitching. He's practicing. He got five strikeouts yesterday, which is really good. Like, really, really good. He's gonna start, right? Oh. Are we both vlogging? Yeah. I think spit you up the vlog. Yeah. What's going on YouTube? Ooh. Just a couple. Let, let JP get done. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. Hi guys. I'm back home from the weekend trip. And I am so bad at filming because the games get really intense, you guys. They get so intense. And I thought we were going to have like time at the hotel to like chill and chat with you guys but day one we got home or we got to the hotel after the two games we dominated those games we did so amazing jp pitched better than i've ever seen him pitch he was on fire i think we won the first game was like 16 to 4 and the second was like 10 to 2 or 10 to something i don't know we did really good we won those and then we all went like the whole team and the coaches went to chili's after so, which was so chaotic. So obviously I just like wasn't thinking of filming and then we got home to, and then we got back to the hotel so late. It was like saliva from Burks, lucky me. Um, I think it was like 8.30, took a shower, got in bed by 9.30 and I passed out. I was so tired. I think just like the sun and like the adrenaline rush you get at these games, we were all really tired. And then the next day we had, that was a championship day, so since we won the first two games, we only had to play one game, and then if we won that game, we went into the championship. If we lost, we went home, and we lost. It was six to seven, it was so close, the boys did so good, and honestly, I know parents all say this, and like family always say this when it comes to their team, but like, there was some bad calls, you guys. Like, there was such bad calls, and I feel like we would've won the game if those calls weren't made, just saying that is the truth i'm like a newbie to baseball and even i knew they were horrible calls um but you can't do anything about it you know and then we it, the the game ended i think at like four i didn't get home till like 6 45 7 o'clock watched a little bit of the hey 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 super bowl um okay let me let them out okay come on come on come on you guys want to go outside I watched a little bit of the Super Bowl. I wanted the 49ers to win, but they didn't, obviously. Um, and the house was pretty clean, actually, when I came home. Joey cleaned the floors. He changed my sheets because he knew I was just so tired and I was really sunburned. I've been in the sun all day. So that was really nice to come home to a clean home. But then today, I just had to do a little bit of my clothes, some laundry, just get caught up. I took this Monday as like a reset day to like get everything done, get the week ready. I wanna film a lot of videos this week, so just prepared that. Today, I am gonna go grocery shopping because my refrigerator is completely empty. Like we have absolutely no food. I did a deep clean on the fridge. I like got rid of all the things that like needed to get thrown out or you know, food that was just like too old to eat, etc. like things that I've made. Um, we're pretty good at that, but there were some things that I had to, that were just too old to eat, and I didn't wanna like get us sick. 
Um, but anyways, we need to go grocery shopping today. We're gonna go to Sam's, and then tomorrow I'm gonna get back to work. I'm editing today, so that is technically work, but like filming-wise, oh my god, what am I talking about? I'm filming today, so that's work. But I have like some sponsorships to do, and emails, and things to get sent in, so that's what I mean by work. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy these videos. Make sure if you do, please comment. It just really helps. I. I really want to get back into like the algorithm of YouTube. I feel like my videos have kind of plummeted and taken a little bit of a lower view count, which is normal when this is your career, especially with TikTok happening and stuff. But YouTube is my home. YouTube is my, my baby. I love YouTube so much and I love sharing my life with you guys. So like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much always for your support. I seriously love you guys so much and I hope you're doing so, so well. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye guys.